Hey guys, what's up Virgo? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. It's going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. Keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. Oy. So this could be your energy or the energy of the person that you're dealing with. So flip-flop it how you need to. Also keep in mind the general reading. So take what's yours, leave the rest behind. Alright, somebody's stressing you like crazy. Or maybe that's you, but I don't think so. They may be keeping this to themselves. The high priestess is there. They may be trying to hide it. Could be financial issues. Could be an earth sign. All right, Virgo. So if this does resonate with you today, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you'd like to contact me for a personal reading, find that information below as well. You left someone behind or they left you behind. It could have been a player, could have been an age difference, could have been kids here. Somebody is stressing you. All right, so Virgo. I'm going to get three cards from this deck for you. This is the angel's answers. So let's see. What the angels have to say for you. I really love this deck. And then we'll kind of bounce that off the um, the cards that come out from the tarot. Okay. Communicate clearly. And it was funny because when I was shuffling your cards, I heard, well, yeah. Um, cutting, somebody's ready to cut through the bullshit. And it was the king of cups. but it, it, So it could have been a water sign, but it doesn't have to be. Um, but the King of Cups is not always terribly ambitious. So this could be someone who carries a lot of emotions, but they don't always show them. Get more information, ask for, okay, wow. So all right, so some may be bouncing back off or something. So, okay. And what I mean is like recovering from something, an addiction, an ex, a loss, something like that. Um, but you got to communicate clearly, ask for help from others, and then get more information. So it seems like there's like others that you're supposed to be reaching out to for something. Even if that's advice, your sister, your mother, your pastor, like it doesn't even seem like it matters who it is here. But... So if there's something that you need or a point that you're trying to get across, really focus on your throat chakra and communicate that clearly because it feels like there could be a, a situation. I don't know why it feels like it's misunderstood or it could be interpreted that way. Like even if you're going to somebody for help, they may not understand what you're trying to get across. Like they may take it the wrong way. All right, so there is something that, you know, even if it's get more information, when, ooh, I told you, somebody's stressing you, but you may need to get more information because it could just be like, um, and this could go both ways. There could be, and I don't know why this is coming up, but I'm going to say it. Um, there's jealousy too, but um, like a need to... Step it up in the bedroom. And it almost feels like on the male side, like the masculine side, like like the female may feel like she's not getting the attention. But I don't think that's true. Because I think, I don't know, we'll see. Communicate, communicate. <laughs> Show me the four cups. Somebody could have rejected an offer. This could have been one that you passed up before. Taurus energy there with the higher fence. Somebody may not have been ready to settle down is what it was. Um, or there could have been a marriage involved. Religious values, things like that. So um, this can also be about going to like a higher, like the, like the church or something and asking for help. But the chariot energy of very... 
Somebody could have wanted to get serious pretty quick. Oy. Somebody was giving it to people in some situations and somebody got fed up with that. Could have been a marriage involved. Somebody just acting immature here. But we do have communicate clearly. So what is the seven of swords? For some, if there's like... Um, wow. Somebody may be intentional. It, the way this could come off could... This is somebody almost like intentionally causing drama. Because there's jealousy around you. With the Queen of Wands there... Um, she can have a lot of admirers. So you may have a lot of people competing for you. Show me the Six of Pentacles. Look, there's a choice here. And you could be keeping this to yourself. Make sure you're trusting your intuition. Because also... I'm going to go back to that. But anyway, so under ask for help from others, right? There's a path. There's a choice here. And it could be between two people because it's like somebody has this choice. They're up in the air weighing options. Um, not sure how to, how to make it, it looks like. Because we have the eight of swords. So in some... Oh. Okay. Because, okay, because it's hard to move forward and make this choice when you're in this mindset. This is a self-imprisonment, self-imposement. And like I said, with the high priestess, somebody could really be keeping that to themselves. So in some of these situations, somebody is juggling, okay? There's, there's competition, there's people, it looks like competing for you. And some, the reason it says communicate clearly is because things are not being like um given enough attention so somebody could be creating drama to either get that attention but also the reason it says communicate clearly is because without that somebody may be so worried that somebody's up to something in some situations okay this is also a secrets card so somebody definitely feels like, you know, has options here, but it also feels like, um, in some situations, like, so this could be bringing a lot of stress and anxiety, and maybe that's where you need to ask for help from others. Talk to somebody, open up, don't just keep it bottled up in this mental tormented hell. Um, if that's, if that's not the case, you know, th this could be leading to things that aren't true, but also at the same time, if somebody's not in t being like, their needs aren't being met. They could be creating drama and that's, you know, um, kind of uncertain and, and I mean, in, in, in most situations, I would call this somebody, you know, having a choice between two things that, that, that's not bringing a lot of balance. But this is causing a lot of like worry underneath of it. So you need to ask, for, like, don't keep it bottled up. Because this is a mental hell. All right, where the hell the cards go? All right, show me this outcome. The Queen of Wands is Aries Leo Sag energy. The Ace of Cups. Get more information. So this, there's, there's something at a dis. You're still waiting. There's still some hold back. We have the two of wands, and we end up with the three. So things are progressing. Um, this is a new, fresh start. You're feeling confident. Um, you may have people competing for you, like I said. But the three of wands is about waiting. Um, it could be something at a distance because there's new cycles trying to begin here. So for others, you're waiting. Um, you are moving forward. But this person with the Knight of Wands and the Empress, they're coming straight towards you. They could be at a distance. The Knight of Wands um, is player energy. 
could be an age difference because we have the queen of wands and the knight of wands so you definitely could be dealing with a fire sign the empress is towards energy there's communication here there's clarity there's revisiting these these issues and this person um i mean honestly it looks like you're dealing with a player but in some situations like if this is a new relationship that this person may have the wrong idea so i'm not sure that they're communicating that clearly like if they haven't came forward they may be worried that you have a lot of competition i know that sounds kind of lazy but in other situations there's kind of a hold back because of um it looks like worrying that there's there's drama around the situation or that somebody has options choices so that would become so they're too worried to speak up and approach the situation and that and, and that can go either way that may be you feeling that way um because there is still some hold back so that would bring this clarity if you communicate clearly in other situations there's a third party here there's a i mean there's somebody that's like Yeah, juggling, giving them more than two people, doing shit to create drama, being a little sneaky there. Um, but somebody's somebody's got feelings there at the end of the day. The moon, Pisces energy. Maybe keeping it hidden. It could be a Cancer Scorpio Pisces coming back around towards you. This could have been somebody who lied to you, betrayed you, juggled you, or would just start drama. Um, so get get the information. Seek clarity. Get things that were hidden beneath this water, and you know, really. In some situations, it could be as easy as like a. Uh, an attention somebody needs more attention and some situations the queen of wands can be the mistress of the deck and we definitely have I mean you gotta communicate clearly get more information this is a general reading so I'm not gonna say that you know everybody's in a third party relationship some are and actually, in this situation, it um, it may be like the female energy. In some situations, it has a lot to do with like passion, romance, that type of thing. Sexual. All right, Virgo, I hope this helps. hope this resonated with you. Um... For some, you already know, because we have secret cards in each category. Things hidden, things not being revealed. Things that are still not seen here. So make sure you get the information, communicate clearly. Ask for support. I mean, talk to friends, family, you know, whoever you trust, that type of thing. Focus on yourself. Know your self-worth. All right, Virgo, hope it helped, hope it resonated. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, find that information below. Also, make sure you click like and subscribe um, as well if this did resonate with you. All right, guys, talk to you later. Bye.